That little boy is trouble. I tell you, if I see that little boy, I'm gonna give him the belt. But not too hard, honey. You know what don't look right. All right, everybody be cool. This is a robbery. No cell phones, no pagers, no attitudes, no alarms, no cops, no one dies. The gentleman over there in the Richard Nixon mask is itching to kill somebody. Seriously. His office meds and his therapist has marked his file with, this guy's a fucking lunatic. In all capital letters. Hang on a sec. Hey, what's with the Nixon mask? I like Nixon. I thought we were, we were going with animal masks. What do people want? Well, I know you like Point Break, but seriously, animals, it's a theme. Themes are important, and you fucked up our theme. So scary. No! Don't take it off, dumbass. Just be a team player next time. Whoa, Jesus. As I was saying, yes, we're taking your money. All of the monies. Dollars, cents, centavos, pesos, pounds, bouillon, ducats, all of that. So please lay face down on the floor with your fingers laced behind your head. This bank, as with all other banks, is insured. Be cool. Nobody be a hero and you'll walk out of here without a scratch. These are all military-grade, fully automatic rifles of exceptionally high caliber. Even one bullet out of the many we will shoot into the bloated, sweaty meat of your body will cause you to have a very bad day. <sighs> Hold on. What? Uh, What's up? What? Wait, why does your gun look like that? Did... Huh? Did you forget the clip? Uh, why is it the clip in your gun? You... You... You left it. Where? In the van? Oh, that's just great. No, no, no. I don't want you to go get it. I don't know if you've noticed, but the robbery has started. We're kind of in the middle of something. You can't call a mulligan and go back out to the van and get the clip. No. It won't work without the clip. It's a machine gun. All the bullets are in there. There are no bullets in the chamber. Didn't you go to the training? No. We had the guy in the warehouse show us all of this. I'm the manager. Wait, hang on. You? You! Sir! Mind your own business. We're having a private discussion here. No, it's... No, fine. It's done. Just stand there and be all menacing. Hopefully no one will notice that you apparently had a bowl of Down Syndrome for breakfast. Oh, well, I don't care if it's hurtful. No, it's not PC. I'm robbing a bank. You think I give two fucks about political correctness? <sighs> yes, I know you have a learning disability, but... Oh, God. Gee, don't, don't cry. Just... <laughs> shit. I'm sorry, okay? I'm sorry, just... Stop crying. You're not retarded. You were nervous. I get it. Yes, 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 yes. Okay, okay. I know. I. Can we just continue here, please? As I was saying, you are all now our hostages. We own you. This will take a while, so I suggest that all of you relax. Get as comfortable as possible, sir. Sir, stop. Stop what you're doing. Get as comfortable as possible without taking off your pants. Put... I know what I said. No one wants to see you hanging dog. What? Shit. I'm serious. If you don't put your pants back on, the tall man in the cow mask over there will shoot your dick off. Thank you. You are all hostages. We have no intention or desire to kill any of you. We will do so if you force our hand. If you do not cooperate, we will end your life. So everyone relax. Pay attention. Please keep your goddamn Oh, oh, the speech, yes. We have prepared a speech. <clears throat> you may think us simple criminals, but I assure you, we are not. We have goals, some would say despicable. These steps we take today are noble necessities. We take this city from the corrupt, the rich, the oppressors of generations who have kept you down with bits of opportunity, and we give it back to you, the people. This city is yours. None shall interfere. Do as you please. Start by storming the prison and freeing the... Damn it. I what? saw that in the Batman movie. Batman? No. No, I didn't steal this from the Batman movie. I did not... Batman. You don't know. You don't know. You didn't even let me finish. This is an original work outlining our manifesto and goals. Batman. Okay, well, it might sound similar to the Batman speech, but it's, it's not that. This is different. I worked very hard on this. Batman. It, hey, shut your ass. Fine. Part of it was Batman. Okay? A little. Not the whole thing. 
It would have sounded a lot better, and you would have realized how awesome it was had you not been all rude and interrupted me. Never mind. Fine. I... Oh, shit, I lost my place. Great. You happy now? We'll just move right along to the demands then, I guess. What? What is it now? Seriously? Are you being serious? I, I thought I told you to go before we left. Well, just hold it. Yes, I said hold it. Okay, now, as I was saying, we are revolutionaries. We are the Order of the Hell Knights. Hell Knights? Wait, is that what we decided on? Order of the Hell Knights? I mean, it's, it's kind of cool, I guess. I just, I don't remember landing on that. It's what? Let's go. Your LARPing guild? <laughs> you shouldn't have said that out loud. Why not? But, well, okay. Well, for one, they can identify you now. How many people are in your guild? Six? Also, you just told everyone that you're a LARPer. I didn't even know that about you. Do you wear, like, armor and shit? Run around talking all funny? No. Really? <laughs> I, I, I didn't know that about you. Well, no. It's, it's not okay. It's pretty motherfucking far from okay. Did you even read our charter? Mm -hmm. We're against LARPing. We're anti-LARPing. It's one of our goals. The elimination of LARPing through any means necessary. No, it, it's fine. I'm, I'm not bigoted against them. I just... I want it waved in my face. Keep that to yourself. Well, I'd, I'd probably have to shoot you or blow up your pretend wizard friends or something. We'll talk about it later. <laughs> Jesus, you're serious. You're not... Okay, no, 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 we'll talk about it later. Anyway, we are the Order of the Hell Knights. We are leading the revolution, and revolutions ain't cheap. With your ill-gotten dollars that you've sucked from the teeth of a hard-working man, we will cull the herd. We will guide our world into a new golden age. This golden age will be free of the following people. Corrupt politicians, lobbyists, the oligarchy, the CEOs, juggalos, cronies, people who don't use their turn signal, people who take professional wrestling too seriously, juggalos, LARPers, assholes who don't tip at restaurants, NASCAR fans, racists, homophobes, old people who think they can drive 20 miles per hour in a 40 mile per hour zone, juggalos, Jerry's ex-girlfriend Samantha, that stupid whore, Je Jerry, did, did you add this? Yeah. When did you guys break up? Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry you guys couldn't work it out. I, I liked it. <clears throat> anyway, and more. This list is developing, but remember those names. Their days are numbered, and the Order of the Hell Knights will rise, taking over Zilker Park with their cardboard sword and silly uniforms. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm sorry. That, that was me. Okay, no, for real now, seriously. To fuel this revolution, we will be taking this bank's money and... Oh, the police are here? Good! I didn't want to have to read the list twice. Okay, good afternoon, law enforcement officers. Your days of fascism are coming to an end. We have 12 hostages at our mercy. If you do not comply, they will be executed with extreme prejudice. Prejudice. Sorry, writing. Prejudice by my men. Except for Carl, since he forgot his fucking play. My demands are for the following. Along with the contents of the vault, we require $300 million in unmarked 20s. A plane at Austin Bergstrom International Airport should be prepped and waiting on the runway. We also have a list of pharmaceuticals that we require immediately. Seven prescription bottles of 100 milligrams of Vicodin. Three cases of LSD. Uh, three freezer bags of all-natural peyote. Twelve bottles of ether. Some DMT. I don't know how that comes, so just plenty of whatever you think is best. Four bottles of toilet bowl cleaner in a gel, because apparently Carl is into some weird shit now. When I say drugs, I mean capital D drugs. I want something that feels like I'm getting a hover from Odin himself. And, ooh, and some nachos. Lenny wants some nachos. Anywhere is fine. Just no olives. Olives make me gassy, and I will not ride all the way to Peru having to deal with that. Anything else? Oh, uh, some drinks. We're gonna need some beverages. Water, uh, tonic, whiskey. Good whiskey. Doesn't have to be scotch, but that certainly doesn't hurt. Uh, you know what? Fuck it. Scotch. The good shit, too. 
nothing less than 15 years old. So no plastic bottles or blends or whatever. You want full bar, full motherfucking bar. Just wheel it on in here, and a bartender too, a good one. Jerry likes old fashions, and I can never seem to get the things right. So send the bartender guy along with the drugs. Wait, what? This, this isn't 551 Commerce Street? Oh, this is a Cracker Barrel. Okay.